Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to a brand new video on my channel. Today we are in beautiful France. Just getting ready for race day. We got pretty sick view over here to Mont Blanc being right there. Um, pretty cool pits parking here. It's super warm today, so um, um, went with the white shorts today and cut off my sleeves as well, even though it doesn't look that cool. I mean, it's all for the gains. Um, so, um, so yeah, this is like the private here parking over here. Um, bike is all ready to go. So uh, we're just heading off to um, the rollout now, and then we start to go and race. So stick along for the video, and uh, we'll be in for a good one. Let's go. Oh yeah, before I start the video. Um, all of the the riding footage is from practice day because I'm not allowed to ride with the GoPro during the race. Um, so unfortunately, uh, I can't ride show any of that footage. But for from the practice day, um, I'll show you the stages. So it makes up for like a whole day video. So it is what it is. So just went out of the rollout, just spelling up to. Stage one now, stage one will be a little bit of pedal just to the gondola, then we take the gondola, a little bit more of pedaling, and then we are at the top, so uh, that one is a lot of pedaling and a, a lot of pushing, like halfway through the track, so um, we'll see how it goes, gonna definitely give my all on that first one because I don't want to lose any time on that one so up on the gondola right now going up to stage one um, super warm already um, it's definitely gonna be a big day out um, so yeah we'll see what happens next shot is gonna be from my practice run and then afterwards I'll tell you how stage one went for the race so um, Let's see what happens. So, up to stage two now. <laughs> Just filled up all the bottles. Did quite a big of a push up. Just having to push up this last bit now. Um, fortunately, had a crash at the top. And then um, bent my shifter holder as well as the button on it. So, I couldn't reach it so every river crossing I did I can shift down so that cost me a lot of energy and then on all the streets it was a bit messy um, but it is what it is I'll put in the screen right now which stage result it was um, and yeah gotta continue now the shifter works still so that's nice so we see what happens Let's go.
Oh fuck. So, stage two is done. Um, we had a half an hour delay, so it took quite a while before we could go, get, get going. But, <coughs> um, we did it. Um, felt pretty good, but stage result was not really what I was hoping, I think. Um, I'll put it in the screen while I was on this stage. Um, but it is what it is. Put the hammer down now for the last last four stages. So let's get it. Okay. okay. Merci. While editing the video right now, I realized I definitely not filmed between stage three and four, and the liaison was super tight. Um, and again, not the greatest um, time, stage-wise. Um, but I was starting to pick up the pace from here on now. Um, so let's tune in straight to stage four and. Um, get some better news after that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Good? Yes. Perfect.
So, stage four done. Refueling. Dad is fixing my shifter. This run was actually quite okay. And the liaison was very tight, so I didn't feel between three and four, this one. Um, but, um, yeah, really tight liaison, so quite in a big rush. Let's see. Line. So last stage of the day, everyone's probably pretty happy they made it after the tight liaisons. Give me another stage, please. Oh my knees, feeling it. <laughs> I'm not feeling it that much anymore, I'm pretty done. So last stage uh, should be maybe a bit of a physical one, depends on how much flow we get. It's going to be physical. Yeah. I'll, I'll assure you. So, yeah, that sprint is going to be brutal. Uh, that's not even one sprint, dude. <laughs> yes. Several. We'll see. It is what it is, but we made it and uh, ready to go. Yo. So just making my way back now to the van. Um, not sure if I feel in between stage five and six, but uh, after stage five, we had quite a mission to get to stage six. Um, stage six actually went super good. Um, went all in on the last one and then got 11th on the last stage, which made me like pull back a lot of times so i'm super super stoked on that best result ever for me 24 so i'm super super stoked on that especially to be able to turn it around after the first three because i was quite far behind on the first three um so yeah solid day out and definitely helped that I raced Valdi Sol last week just for speed, um, let's say um, side, just for mentally to process how fast you can go um, and see how, like how fast you 
yeah, how I actually can go, sorry for my very bad talking. Um, but yeah, I'm super stoked. Um, 24th on the day. And yeah, I think 19 on one of the last stages, like stage five, I believe. And then the last one, 11th. So super stoked on that. My dad is washing the bike right now, but big shout out to him for helping me get the bike running all good. And uh, yeah, super, super good weekend. Really enjoyed the race here. It was super cool that they had like a proper, like um, private deer parking over here. That helped a lot. And um, especially nice for uh, private deers like, like us to be somewhat close to the race venue because usually we're quite far away. So shout out to the guys from the organization for us to get some some good parking and uh, yeah cheers to all the sponsors for making it possible stick to the end of the video and or go to the description if you want to support me and uh, the brands behind uh, behind all of the all of these videos so hope you guys enjoyed the video and big shout out again to the man himself, DJ Paul. <laughs> running, making the bike running all good. The bike was running well good. I had the Dirty Dan, Mud Tie on the front, cut, and then Magic Mary on the back. Super good, and bike was running mint so fast on the straight. So even with a Dirty Dan on that last stage, the rolling speed didn't make that much of a difference. And then, uh, yeah, thanks to Canyon, of course. Montserrat, the guys hooking me up with uh, all the clothing and some travel budget. So cheers to those guys and all the sponsors involved. And um, yeah, now getting ready for Leger basically, back to downhill and then back to Enduro again. So I'm stoked, I'm stoked on that. I really enjoy the switch between one discipline and the other. And I feel like it definitely helps me. So yeah, super cool, cool day. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. And thanks for sticking along all the way to the end of the video and yeah thanks again and see you guys in the next video thank you ciao ciao